Hi friends, this is Professor Dr. Sanjeev Mahanti, Senior Consultant and Head, Institute of ENT Head Neck Surgery, MGM Healthcare. In these trying times with coronavirus related knowledge panning every social window and media all through, I thought it wise to talk a bit about a very common symptom such as sore throat during corona times. Part of the clinical syndrome which encompasses COVID symptoms alongside sore throat can manifest ranging from a small tickle in the throat to painful swallowing and the duration of symptoms of throat irritation is an indication of the probable underlying cause. An extremely short duration of sore throat can be attributed to an infective cause. But what are the usual complaints these patients would complain about? It could be ranging from a small throat irritation, episodic throat pain, painful swallowing, sense of burning sensation, sore throat with fever, sore throat with dry cough, cough with expectoration, sore throat with nasal block, maybe with breathing difficulty. In such a condition, what is the role of a specialist? A good history taking pertaining to sore throat is mandatory to rule out the possibility of COVID-19 in these trying times. We need to be cautious if there is persistent sore throat with an association of one or more symptoms of COVID like dry cough, without expectoration, breathlessness, fever and probably decreased or altered sense of smell and taste. This is as far as we know in today's world. It's an evolving event. So anything, any kind of presentations can happen with regards to COVID. But if any of these symptoms are associated with sore throat, which the patient perceives as annoying, these patients need to be evaluated as per established guidelines and protocols worldwide. However, if sore throat is a standalone symptom, the following remedies can be instituted till a very good purposeful evaluation is done once the lockdown is released. Warm saline gargling at regular intervals. Drinking lukewarm water just to allay the feel of the throat when you swallow. Sleeping in elevated position, maybe an extra pillow. Frequent short light meals so that the effect of reflux doesn't happen. Steam inhalation at regular intervals. It's pertinent to understand that we need to get our body hydrated as well. So, good amount of water and fresh fruit juice, avoidance of oily and spicy food, not to forget a good hygiene etiquette in and around where you stay. It could be cleaning the AC filters at regular intervals, if at all you are using the air conditioner and changing bed sheets. Now that you are locked inside, there's a tendency to overuse and take it lightly. So cleanliness inside the home is equally important. An early dinner would be useful. And just in case the sore throat persists and it's painful, a short course of broad spectrum antibiotics is not a bad idea along with antacids 
and some vitamin C supplements. Sometimes even beta in gargle will be of help. Needless to say, an absolute no is indulgence in any tobacco related activity or smoking. That includes seizure, smoking, tobacco chewing, which can aggravate the symptoms. All these steps are for better health in addition to the required strict adherence to physical distancing and good hand hygiene etiquettes. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay indoors, stay positive and stay hopeful. Till next, if there is a problem which is very very incapacitating, don't hesitate to go for the new guidelines for telehealth consultation.